was born in Kenya. And indeed, Kenya is a blessed country. The beauty and the nature of Kenya is that beautiful and catchy. It is said that Kenya attracts at least 1 to 1.4 million visitors per year. Everyday tourists visit Kenya and some of the reasons why they visit Kenya are wildlife viewing and examples of wildlife viewing include animals and animals include lions, elephant, zebras and many more. Another reason why tourists visit Kenya include learning about cultures. Cultures include the Maasai community. They are also attracted by mountains and examples of the mountains include Mount Kenya, Mount Elgon, the Menegai Crater and many more mountains found here in Kenya. So, those are some of the reasons why tourists visit Kenya. But, despite having mentioned those factors, I can't go without mentioning the main factor which drilled the genesis of this documentary. That figured reason is the rivers in Kenya. Kenya has many rivers which also have law of attracting tourists. Examples of those rivers include River Tana, River Nzoia, River Adi, River Chana, River Nyado, and many more rivers. In today's video, I am going to take you through the River Madhyoya. River Madhyoya is a river which starts from Abadea Forest. Abadea Forest has a park which goes by the name as Abadea National Park. This is a protected area in the Abadea Mountains. In central Kenya, Abadea ledges are located in the east of East African Lift Valley. It covers the highest area and the Abadea salient to the east. Abadea Ledge is 160 km long mountain. Its elevation is approximately 4,001 meters. It straddles across the counties of Nyadalwa, Nyali, Kiabu, Laikipia, and Mulanga. Today, I am filming River Madhyoya. I am located in Kihalo constituency. Kihalo constituency is found in Molanga County. River Madhyoya is a magical scene and some of the activities which are carried in River Madhyoya include fishing, sand harvesting, farming and main factor we are going to focus today is it is a tourist destination. Some of the colored activities on this day by the tourists include rafting, boat riding, kayaking, and many more. Despite River Madhyoya having this advantage, it also got some of the disadvantages.
term of the disadvantages which encounter liver mazoya is you cannot navigate in liver mazoya from Abadia ledges to Indian Ocean. Inside the liver you could encounter with big locks, bushy islands in the liver and main one of them is the liver reduces water volume when there is no lens. Liver reduces water such that you can cut across the liver with your shoe put on and end up without getting wet. As a proof, I decided to show you this video. You can see, this is the man crossing across the liver. He is holding his saddles, which means this liver has a lot of locks. Despite showing here, I also preferred mostly to take you through the same liver towards the northern area. When I'm going to show you big locks. was once prided by an author, the book which goes by the name The Liver Between. This book was written by one of the great authors of Africa. The author goes by the name Goge Wadhyongo. He once written about the liver between two lads, and that liver was this liver I'm showing through. This liver is liver Madhyoya. Today I am not here to discourage his lighting, but kindly allow me to say, this liver, which goes by the name liver Madhyoya, is also a killer liver. In one of the most watched Kenyan television, that goes by the name Citizen Television, several reported that some college students were drawn by the waters they had gone there for occasion but later during the day that occasion changed to tears <laughs> some of the michuki college students were here to swim but accidentally some of their colleagues ended up being drawn by the water in the river the liver is indeed a killer liver. Thank you so much for watching this documentary. My name is Lewis Jaha and this is my YouTube channel. Kindly remember to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.